Diseases in plants are caused by infections due to pathogens, which include bacteria, fungi, viruses, or parasites. Problems which are attributable to the environment or nutritional imbalances are sometimes regarded as disorders. Problems can be considered as being in one of these three possible categories. The plant has either too little or too much of one or several particular nutrients available to it. Plants require nutrients for healthy growth, much the same as we do. Whilst nutrient imbalances can render a plant weak and open to disease, nutrient deficiency diseases are more common than nutrient toxicity diseases. The environmental conditions are not suitable. As with nutritional problems, inappropriate environmental conditions can result in weak and susceptible plant tissue. Examples include too much or too little water, temperatures outside of the plant's preferred range, too much or too little sunlight, and so on. Nutritional and environmental diseases are referred to as non-pathogenic diseases. Whilst the environment and nutrition can stimulate plant diseases, they can also occur because a plant has a generic abnormality of some type. One or several other organisms that interfere with the health of the plant are called pathogens. The diseases they cause are referred to as pathogenic diseases. They may also be referred to as infectious diseases because the diseases are often the result of infections which can spread to other plants. Parasitic organisms can attack a wide variety of different plants, but most only attack a small range of plants, and some are species specific, being unable to grow on other species. Essentially, diseases cause reduced efficiency in plant growth and function. Causes of diseases produce a wide range of symptoms in plants such as dieback, wilting, stunting, rots, spots, blights, discoloration and deformity, just to name a few. It is important to be aware of these symptoms and treat the plant accordingly.